Hell no longer needs that portal to enter this world. The invasion you saw was only the first wave. The Hellgate is capable of sending millions of my children into your world. Soon, the fleet from Earth will be here, and with their ships, we will bring this hell to Earth. This hell. He's no longer human. Campbell went after him. He 
He's got to be stopped. <coughs> Hell is breaking through in the caverns. If that portal isn't closed before those ships arrive, Earth will be destroyed. Earth. <coughs> That's what they've always wanted. They were there once. Lost it in the dawn of time. Now it's so close. They can taste it. It's up to you now. <laughs> Take my PDA. It's got what you need. Good luck. I'm too beat up. I'll slow you down. I'll try to make it out on my own. It's up to you now. This is the audio log of Counselor Elliot Swan, dated November 15th, 2145. This entire research facility is in chaos. There's at least a 90% death rate among civilian personnel. Whatever Betruger unleashed is literally consuming the base. People have been turned into some sort of undead creatures that are relentless. Campbell and I are making our way towards the communications facility. We must stop all communications. If a distress call leaves the base, then everyone here and on Earth is doomed. This is the audio log of Counselor Elliot Swan, dated November 16, 2145. Campbell and I were unable to reach the main portal in the Delta Complex, but that portal may be inconsequential to a more disturbing discovery. We have uncovered reference to another portal, created by the demons themselves, a passageway between Hell and Mars. We suspect it resides within the cavern somewhere near the archaeological dig. The fleet is on its way. Campbell and I will attempt to move there and somehow either shut it down or destroy it. That... that... hellhole must be closed before the fleet arrives.